Is your subconscious sabotaging the growth of your business? I'm Carol Bernadette Boskert of the Blueprint Group Practice, and I'm a sales coach and business mentor. And I help people to sell with ease, to attract those high value clients, those clients that become lifetime clients and buy from you again and again. You see, there is a gap between what people say, what business owners say, and what business owners actually do. And that is always the giveaway as to whether your subconscious is sabotaging the growth of your business. You see, often we can make these really big intentions or these grand promises or, you know, as they call them, those BHAG, those big, hairy, audacious goals about what we're going to do in our business. And as much as we mean it at the time, what happens is our subconscious is really running the show and it's saying, I don't think so. I don't think you're going to do that because it's scared. It's scared. It's the unknown. You don't know what's going to happen. So what we need to do if we have a big goal that maybe has been on our list for a couple of years now, or even for the last 12 months, and you've made absolutely no inroads on it, or you've got nowhere near that end point, then what you need to do, first of all, is to become the observer in your business. So take a step back, look at what you're saying, and look at what your action is, because your behavior will always give you the clues as to what's really going on. Now, then, the probability is that you need to do some mindset work around it. And of course, there can be different levels of mindset. It can be things such as getting up in the morning, having a great morning routine that sets you up for the day and shifts you into a high vibration so that you start to take those first steps. Or you might need to work with a mindset expert that's going to help you to really shift those stubborn blocks that are in you, that are stopping you from even starting that really big goal. So there might be some mindset work there for you to do. The next thing, of course, you've got to get super practical. You need to have a plan in place. You need to know the exact steps that you're going to take that's going to help you get there. Because often what happens is once we take that first step, we can start to create the momentum that we need. And through momentum and taking action, we get motivated. So how aware are you? of your subconscious and whether that is sabotaging your business. Let me know in the comments below. Bye for now and I'll see you in the next video.